The environment in classrooms is very collaborative. I think people just really value intelligence and just curiosity in general. In middle school, we got to pick our languages that we wanted to study, and my friend chose Russian. She convinced me to choose Russian too. I'm still taking Russian, which I never expected to be doing. Both the Russian teachers, the middle school Russian teacher and the upper school Russian teacher, they both have a lot of passion for what they do and they're really invested in their students. Our teacher encourages us a lot to go out and pursue other opportunities outside of school to learn Russian. So I actually went to study in Moldova over the summer and I intensively studied Russian for six weeks. It was my Russian teacher who convinced me to do that. The teachers here are really good at helping to encourage that passion and curiosity. It's really easy here to pursue multiple things. I'm really interested in Russian, but I'm also really interested in math and science. Resilience is when you don't give up and you just keep on trying. In second grade, I was really challenged with the vision and multiplication. My math teacher, Mr. Rookwood, came over to me and they said, are you ha having trouble with this? And they said, yes, can you help me? And then he made me into a very good math student. I went out and I started getting better at long division. It took a really long time for me to get good at it. It felt good being good at it because then I was one of the best kids in my math group. And I was happy because nobody ever thought that I was that good at math. When I get older, I'm going to be very happy that I'm good at math. In class, it's a lot more comfortable knowing that like your classmates are there and you can rely on them to um, for them to help you when you don't understand yeah. something. And you always know that if you don't understand something, you're not alone. And so you can always go to someone and there's always going to be someone sitting right next to you that can help you with it. A lot of times certain teachers, they'll say, is anyone having trouble with like this part? And so actually, there are a couple people here that are also having trouble with She can go help each person individually and hope that every person gets back on track. Everyone's really working together and we try really hard to and then you just do three plus four, which would be seven X. Everyone learns differently, and like everyone, a friend like, has come to know that, and we all respect it. And so when someone doesn't understand something, we all, instead of making fun of it, we'll all like sort of pitch in to help, instead of like thinking it's silly that I don't understand it. We all like build with each other to make sure that we all get it as a group.